UAE students uh, have a lot of nice events and they have been raising money for Gaza. Now, speaking more of that, the Gulf Medical University put together a Christmas market, which is actually very good, showcasing handmade goods, delicious treats, and entertaining activities suitable for people of all ages. Now, the initiative reflects a powerful blend of festivity and philanthropy with students recognizing the importance of extending a helping hand during the holiday season. The market was not only an opportunity for the students, the staff and the faculty to come together in joyous celebration, but also a collective effort to make a meaningful difference in the lives of those who have, been in, uh, who have endured the ravages of the war. Now proceeds from the event will be directed towards the Emirates Red Crescent's humanitarian efforts in Palestine and providing aid and assistance to the war-torn victims. I think it's really important to highlight these stories because... Um, of course, the Emirates Red Crescent is working tirelessly to make sure that aid gets to the victims. Uh, and we saw massive um, community uh, activations, especially you know in the last two or three months, but that can't stop. That needs to continuously happen. So it's amazing to see this university getting behind the cause and putting all donations to Emirates Red Crescent. As you said, we have seen the UAE help what's uh, the victims and people of Gaza and Palestine specifically. And to see that universities and schools specifically, because as well my old school, and everyone around actually putting extra initiative to help the Gaza people and victims of the war, which is amazing. I even have a friend actually who has um, has a small business and she actually did help You know, by flying, she collaborated with the Red Crescent and actually did fly to the Rafah port wow. in Gaza to actually help the victims, which is really a good uh, cause. By the way, guys, even if you guys just like share a post, you're helping. Even mm-hmm. if you're talking, even if you're maybe increasing awareness, that itself is help. So why yeah. not? Help so in true. Any way. And we saw yes. so many small businesses do that. I know. Uh, That was one thing that we were able to highlight here is not just kind of the bigger charitable initiatives, but even the small businesses taking donations and sending it to the Emirates Red Crescent. Because people are like, what can I do? We're sitting here counting our blessings, feeling very privileged. How can we help? And that's what we saw in the last couple of months. But what we're saying is we also don't want it to stop. So it's amazing to see this university. Did you say it's your old university? No, it's not. Uh, I saw my old school actually as well have an initiative done for Gaza, which sadly I couldn't attend. But it was just like nice and hard and very heartwarming when you see that um, it's not only, I would say, the country is helping. You know, the, yes, the UAE is helping a lot in so many ways, but as well, you know, like individuals, as little as it is, even with like helping and so on, uh, it's, it's beautiful at this point because I can't imagine what people who live in Palestine and specifically Gaza and who are victims of the war feel like or we, we could never, no matter how much we go like, oh yeah, we, we understand and we sympathize with them. But we could never, ever, ever just imagine how it's like to be in their place. Yeah. So speaking of that,